Hey friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to bring you guys this Dollar Tree haul today because I found some really cool items that I know you're gonna love. So if that's something you're interested in, then just keep watching. So as always, you guys, I'm not gonna edit this down, just so you know. Number one, I'm pregnant. Number two, it's hot. Number three, I'm finally back to crafting. So I need to get back out there and finish that up. So um, I'm just gonna dive right in. Now, some of these items I did the video, so just keep that in mind. Um, but I'm not gonna like do this in any certain way. I'm just gonna grab it random. So the first thing I found that was new to my store, to me, whatever, are these little tag chalkboards. Now two um, come together for $1.25. And they're okay size. They're not like real, real big or real small. So they're kind of like medium size, if you will. So I only picked up one pack of those. And then they also had these. So again, you could do many things with these. Glue them together and make like little tags. Um, lots of ideas. They also had the exact same thing in the whiteboard on the tag and these, but I'm not a really big fan of that. Um, but if I can find a clip, I will pop that up on the screen. So the next item I found were these permanent writable white stickers. Now you guys know that they have been coming out with vinyl and weeding tools and just all kinds of tools for the Cricut. So this is a new one for your Cricut or, you know, cut it and use it totally up to you. It's kind of a small um, roll and there's 48 inches in here. They also had a bunch of new galvanized wreath signs. Again, I can pop that up on the screen. But I just picked up the welcome. I'm not really a big fan of like the sayings that were on them. So I thought this one was cute with the flowers at the bottom and then the welcome. So that's why I picked this one up, but I don't know. I'm just, they're just kind of like not my style. I don't know. You guys can let me know in the comments what you guys think of the galvanized wreaths. Now you guys asked me to do a beach theme video so I did pick up a few things to do that because I looked in my stash and y'all, I literally have nothing to, I think I might have like one pack of shells maybe. I'm not too sure. The point is beach and nautical theme is not my thing, but you guys asked me to do it. So I picked up a few things for that. Um, this one has like three different tails. And if you guys remember from a few videos back, I'll link that in the cards. But I did pick up like the swimming mermaid and um, another mermaid with the idea of doing something for my girl's room. But now that I'm deciding to do a video, I might save that for that. Anyway, the next item I picked up Dollar Tree is doing a really good job coming out with like the wood items. Now, I don't know if that's good for $1.25, but you're also paying for the convenience of it already being cut and ready to go for you. So that's kind of a factor in it. But I picked up three of these just to have. I also picked up a different size. I, I meant to grab that, um, but I'm using them in my DIY video. And they're a, they're a little bit longer. They're probably maybe double this. Again, I will pop up a picture on the screen just so that way you guys kind of get an idea of what I'm talking about. So the next item, this these are new. I've never seen these before. Um, macrame cord, y'all? What? And Dollar Tree ain't paying attention, right? Yeah. So I picked up two of those. Even though I have a big thing of macrame cord, my best friend Nicole at the Weeks Nest, go check her out. She uses macrame all the time. So I shopped her links and got her favorite macrame. So when I picked these up, it reminded me of her. But go show her some love. Let her know I sent you. Um, she does all kinds of amazing Dollar Tree DIYs and lots of good stuff over there. So go check her out. 
And then along the beachy theme, now these are these are not new items, but again, I didn't have any of this stuff, so I knew that I should probably pick some up if I'm doing a beach theme video for you guys. So I picked up a pack of just plain shells, and then I picked up a little jar of shells, and I also picked up another little jar of shells. Now, I don't know if I'll, I thought I picked up another one. I'm sure I'll find them in here somewhere. But again, along the lines of the beach theme, I picked up one of these galvanized lighthouses. And then I also picked up one anchor. And one steering wheel. What is this? <laughs> Pregnancy brain is real is in full effect. I was about to say the real deal is real and in full effect all at the same time, but <laughs> pregnancy brain is in full effect, y'all. What is this? A wheel? A, st a something? I don't know. Obviously, I don't do much nautical decor, but I know y'all will let me know in the comments down below. Okay, so I think that's it for the beach theme. Don't quote me, but I'm sure we'll find it if, if there is anything else. Now, these are definitely new. I've never seen them before. I think I've seen this style jar, maybe. I'm not too sure. But look at the little bee on there. Sorry, that's going to drive me nuts. Guess the tie got messed up. Look how gorgeous that is. Now, I know a lot of... I know a lot of y'all like the bee themed, the bee theme. So if you do, these are the two colors I found. So run to your local Dollar Tree and pick these up because they're absolutely gorgeous. Now I picked up two of like the pinky purple color and I picked up one of the green. Oh, along the lines of the beach theme, I also picked these up. They're like glass beads, like shards of glass beads, crushed glass. And I had an idea to do with the mermaid with these. So that's why I picked this up. And then I also picked up, these are new. I've never seen these before. Now I've seen mirrors, but not this size. So I'm not sure like if that's worth $1.25 because they're so cheap, you know? But they are a little bit thicker. So they're not like that smaller version or I should say thinner version. So these are super thick. So I picked up two of them. I'm not sure what I'll do with them, but I picked up two just to have them. Um, that my store had a bunch, so I knew that if I needed to go back and grab them, that hopefully they would be there, but y'all know how that goes too. So I'm not gonna hold my breath, right? Sorry y'all, it is so, it's like 95 degrees here. Okay, moving on. Y'all, really Farm Fresh established 1905. Now, these are the stencils I'm not a big fan of. However, I still will use them. So, I picked up one of those. And then these are new rub-on transfers. I picked up two packs of these. And they've got, like, all the little farm animals, cow... Um, bull, right? <laughs> Y'all, my brain is just not with it today. You got a little jug of milk, some greenery, cutting board. Look, there's even a pumpkin on there, a jar. So I thought that was fun. I picked up two. And then the next one I picked up for my girl's room because I'm doing like a boho theme in there. 
So I figured that I could do something with these, who knows. Hang on y'all, potty break. <laughs> okay, sorry y'all. The ketones are amazing. If y'all are drinking ketones with me, then you know what I mean. They're amazing, but the potty breaks are just insane. Anyway, if you guys want ketone information, add me on Facebook to my personal page. I'll have that linked in the link tree. You'll see Facebook personal page. Add me there, send me a message, and I will get y'all hooked up. Anyway, oh, I knew I picked up another one of these. So I just picked up one of those little shells. And these are perfect too. Like once you're done with the shells, you can use the jars for decor. You can use them as little bud vases. So many ideas with these little jars once you're done with them. So don't throw them away. But if y'all are anything like me and you're a craft hoarder, then you probably have so much stuff you don't need that is trash, but in your brain, you think you're going to be able to use it for something because that's me. <laughs> I think I can literally use everything. Boxes, like everything, but anyway. Okay, next item I picked up are these amazing jars. Now, these are not new. Um, these have been around for a while, but I picked up four of them because I have an idea. I'm not sure if th that's what I'll do with it, but these are gorgeous to leave on your counter, um, put pasta in them. So many ideas because these are really, really good size. The next items I picked up, again, I have never seen them. Where'd the other one go? Okay, I guess I'll find it in a minute. But anyway, I found the natural wood as well as black and white letter tiles, like for Scrabble. You know how everybody uses these all the time? Well, now Dollar Tree has them. Really? But they're not paying attention, y'all. They're not paying attention to us, just so you know. <laughs> anyway, picked up one pack of those. Now, I probably should have picked up more packs because you can't spell many words with just 26 letters from the alphabet. However, um, I picked them up just to show you guys. I probably personally will never use the black and white, but you never know. Next item I picked up are, was this, I was about to say, are these, was this embroidery needle bundle. And I got this because I use needles to put in the end of my ribbon. That way it doesn't unroll on me. So there is a tip for you guys. If you're having trouble trying to figure out how to keep your ribbon like wrapped up, use pins on the end. So I picked up one of these so that way I could put my pins in it. Now, the moment you've all been waiting for. When I walked in Dollar Tree and I saw this, I was like, are you kidding me right now? Like for $1.25. Now, I'm not sure if it's the most amazing deal. A, a few of these items definitely are not because uh, I'll just explain as I go. A freaking pegboard system at Dollar Tree? What? what like are you for real right now and i did not know this because i wanted to set it all up and show you guys and film it yeah right on the front of it it says no need to drill holes in the wall with our installation method we provide self-adhesive mounting brackets sold separately 
So once I saw that, I literally went on the hunt to try to find the mounting brackets and I can't find them. So why they would sell this without the mounting bracket, I'm not positively too sure, but they did. And now I have to wait to find the mounting system because my idea was on my new craft table, I wanna put these up and then take the cups that I found and put my paint brushes on there on the sides of my table. That way I don't have my table all cluttered up. So I picked up four of these. So I picked up four of the panels, four packs. So um, eight all together. And so I was thinking four on one side, four on the other. But I could also use these cups in my pegboard as well. So I picked up four of the cups. I picked up three of the trays. Look how cool these are. I've never even seen these for regular pegboards. I mean, I know that they sell them, but my point is I've never like searched for a pegboard tray. I've never seen one. So my idea for this was to have on the side of my table and set my glue gun down, my blow dryer, whatever the case may be that needs to like sit upright um, that I need to have on my table, but I don't want to have on there. I thought this would be perfect for that as well. So like I said, I picked up three of the shelves. I only picked up one of the squared shape tray. And, oh, here's the natural wood letters. And last but not least, now these are most definitely not worth it. Do not buy these from Dollar Tree. If you get the pegboard system, go on Amazon, go to Home Depot, go somewhere else and get like a big pack of these because for three loop hooks for $1.25, it's just not worth it. You can get a big pack of like a variety for much cheaper. So I only picked up one of those. And then I also picked up one of the ring hooks. Um, again, I thought this would be really good for my blow dryer to just like stick down in there so that it would sit upright. But we'll have to see on that. I don't know if it'll fit. I'm pretty sure it will. But again, this is another one. Don't waste your money. Go to Amazon, go to Home Depot, Walmart. Somewhere is the point and pick these up because you can get them for cheaper. So, I believe that is all I have for you guys today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I had such a fun time showing you guys all these items. I'm so excited to be back in my craft shed. If you guys have not seen that video, I will link it in the cards in the right hand corner. I moved my craft shed. I organized it. My husband helped me. Thank God for him, you guys. He's literally a saint in my eyes. Nobody can tell me different about him. Um, I, I could not do what I do without him and his support and his help. So I just love to give him a shout out. But my shed looks amazing. I am having so much fun crafting in there. So if you guys want to see that video, check it out. And you should have a DIY video up by now, hopefully. Fingers crossed, you never know with life. But anyway, you guys, thanks again for hanging out with me. As always, if nobody has told you today, you are absolutely stunning and gorgeous. You are worthy. You can do anything you set your mind to. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye. Check out the videos that are popping up here to your left while you're waiting on my next upload or join the DIY fam here to your right.